This is Jamar Chase, one of the best wide receivers in the NFL and a reigning rookie of the year. His became one of the best receivers in the league in just two years. But today we're gonna wipe all that away and make him a zero overall. And the only way he can get upgraded is based on his performances. For every yard that Jamar Chase accumulates will be plus one to any of his upgrades. And if we can't get him to a 99 overall by week five, I have to give away a Jamar Chase Bengals jersey to one of my lucky subscribers. And considering I did not want to drop $150 on this jersey, I went to Jamar Chase in the very first play of week one. <laughs> no! Joe Burrow! I'm ass! That pick was so crucial because for every game that I lose this season, Jamar Chase's stat line will be cut in half, meaning I will only get half the points. So every game is so crucial, we cannot lose. Jamar, please catch it! The season just started and things were starting off so slim. <laughs> Catch it, dude. And no matter how hard I tried, I could just not get Jamar Chase the ball at all. Oh my God. And then finally he got on the board. Yes, we caught it. Only for one yard though. But in these types of challenges, we take the small dubs where we can take them. Not too much we can complain about unless you throw an interception like this. Oh my God, DJ Watt did not just stun on us like that. He just showboated. it. And yeah, that was essentially how week number one went. <laughs> Jamar Chase finished with two receptions for 20 yards. Meaning that's only 10 points. God damn. And considering we needed those 10 points so badly, I decided to put it to a stat that I needed severely. Yeah, you know what? 10 catching isn't going to do a lot, but you know what? It's going to do something. And that's all that matters, right? To just, just do something, Jamar. And in the week number two, I really had to focus because I, I was taking this as a whole joke week one, but week two, I really had to lock in. Jamar, yes, we will take that. Eight <laughs> yards. And on fourth down, it was only right. I went right back to number one. Fourth down, he's a demon in the clutch. And with Jamar Chase being such a low overall, that also meant his stamina was at a zero. So I only had him for a certain amount of plays. So I really had to make every single play count. Oh, Jamar Chase, we're balling, dude. We are, we are, Jamar, you were clutch. And yet I continue to go right back to Jamar. Okay, we dropped it, back to reality. So I had to settle for the quick field goal because you know, we had to win this game. We had to get the points, as, as many points as possible. So I gladly took my three and got back on the field with Jamar. And so I went right back to the short routes and Jamar Chase could still not catch those. And then he finally got another catch. Yes, Jamar. Yes, please. Then on fourth down, he makes another drop. Yeah, that was fourth down, Jamar. He really had to do that to me. And then I quickly discovered the wide receiver screens in the playbook. So I spanned these a couple times. Just a cherry picking us, get as many yards as possible. Oh my God, go. Yes, four yards. Then I went right back to it again. Oh no, we're gonna lose yards that time. Another third down. Jamar Chase letting me down yet again. And then Jamar Chase was wide open on fourth down and he makes the catch. Jamar Chase, thank you because if you dropped that, we were screwed. And we threw to Jamar one more time and he made the grab. Okay, we're starting to string together a couple, a couple good ones. On third down, we needed a crucial grab. Jamar Chase wide open, does not make the catch. All right. And it was fourth down yet again. I went right back to Jamar and he didn't get it. Okay. And with a quick turnover forced by the defense, we got right back in the red zone. Okay, Jamar, let's do this. Let's score a touchdown. What do we say? <laughs> Just, we, we gotta catch the ball first. We, we, we gotta catch the ball. <laughs> and yet I went right back to him because why not? Oh, Jamar! The catch! And with a golden opportunity to get Jamar Chase's first touchdown, I couldn't pass it up. Jamar! Yes! He got it! Yes! He actually did it! He did it! And scoring that touchdown just negated the half points if we were to lose. So whatever yards we get in this game, regardless win or lose, we get to keep it all. Okay, let's well, go that we scored that touchdown because we got killed. Jamar Chase with 97 yards. And a touchdown. Love to see it. And with a solid 97 points to upgrade Jamar Chase, this is what I went with. Okay, so we're going to put 90 of it on catching. Yes, that is very crucial. And I put the last seven on short route running. Okay, yeah, it sounds about right. I mean, I don't know how much seven route running is going to move move the needle, but hopefully enough. <laughs> and just like that, we're still at 12 overall. Okay. I guess 99 catching does not boost you up in overall at all. And with Jamar Chase now being able to actually catch the ball, it made things quite interesting. Jamar Chase went an easy four yards. You love to see it. Oh, yeah. Show off that stat line from last week, by the way. Mm. <laughs> Although it was still very hard to get open. Jamar, what a crab! He still was able to catch things. Okay, now we're gonna try a slant route because why not? He's gonna catch it, of course, dude. 99 catching is a such a big difference. And with this 99 catching, I'm not gonna lie, I got a bit greedy. I made a couple throws I probably shouldn't have. Oh my god, how did he just catch that? Jamar Chase, you are a freak. And with another golden opportunity in the red zone, I knew I had to get this touchdown with number 
number one. Come on, Jamar. Oh, he's wide open. Look at him. He's wide open. Jamar Chase with his second touchdown in back-to-back -back weeks. Oh, look at him hit the gritty. Oh, yeah, that's a well-deserved gritty. Having 99 catching and having an X-Factor lit quarterback, my confidence was through the roof. Oh, Jamar Chase. They can't guard us. He can knock seven for eight. Last week, it was like six for 18. And of course, we went right back to the man. Oh, dang. He couldn't catch that. And this drive was pretty much the Jamar Chase show. We went right back to him again and again and again as his stat line was going through the roof. Jamar, yes. <laughs> You're so tired, but I'll take it. And Jamar Chase was, in fact, tired. So I had to run it a couple times and just get give him a breather on the sideline. And now with Jamar Chase in the field, we went right back to him. Maybe the show goes on. Jamar, get up. Get up. Yes, Jamar Chase, touchdown number two. Oh, he's going crazy. And what can I say, man? That pretty much encapsulated this game. Jamar Chase finally arrived, even though he was only a 12 overall, the 99 catching made all the difference in the world. 31 to 17, what a big game. And not only was it a big game for the Cincinnati Bengals, but same for Jamar Chase. 18 receptions, 194 yards, and three touchdowns. This man has arrived. Jamar Chase has finally arrived, ladies and gentlemen. And with all of those points, we went crazy. Yeah, we're gonna go 99 speed and 96 stamina. Oh yeah, that stamina is gonna come in clutch. I don't know if you believe it's gonna come in clutch, but trust me, with this man on the field, oh, it will make all the difference in the world. By the way, we gotta get this short route running up. It's, that's not gonna cut it. And we're still at 12 overall. Okay, wow. And jumping into week four with week five quickly approaching the horizon. As much as I love you guys, I mean, $150 is $150, and uh, I, I kinda need to complete this challenge. Oh, Jamar Chase, 99 speed. Oh my God, the 99 speed is big time. And yet again, we went right back to number one. Oh, dude, he is a machine. Yeah, like this man is a 12 overall, but like the 99 speed is just so cracked. And once again, we went right back to the man. Oh, dude, he is amazing. And with Jamar Chase, we literally marched right down the field. Oh my God, Jamar Chase. Holy sh- And with the Dolphins answering very quickly, we had to have a response of our own. Oh my God, Jamar Chase is just like, he's just jogging out there. And then once he gets the ball, he's just a full on, full on sprint. And yet again, we went right back to the man of the hour. Oh, please catch it. Thank you. For as humble as I can say it, week four was, was a breeze. I'm just going to say it. That 99 speed and 95 stay, I'm going to just unlock a total different level for Jamar Chase. Oh, he is insane. Come on, cut up, cut up. Oh, we needed it. Yeah, that didn't stop me from getting Jamar Chase another touchdown. Oh my. Yeah, that was pretty much how this game went. And with another defensive turnover in the red zone, we had Jamar Chase primed for his third touchdown of the half. Jamar Chase, touchdown number three. Look at him jump in the stands. Oh, yes, sir. Look at all those happy Bengals fans. That might be you guys because I don't know how I'm going to get this guy to a 99 overall in week five. Hey, this was a shootout for sure. 41 to 30. Jamar with 11 receptions, 169 yards, and four touchdowns. He has finally arrived. And with yet another stellar performance, we get to upgrade so many things for Jamar. Yeah, I'm liking this right now. 99 short route running, 60 medium route running, and up. Okay, yeah, 10 deep route running. You got me there. We're still at 12 overall. Okay. And with week number five now arriving, and as such a monumental game this was, the second decision was made that every yard would double in points. So essentially, this was a double weapon XP weekend. You know, if you're Kyler Murray, you like to play Call of Duty. So this was the time we had to show out. Oh, yes, sir, Jamar. See, so yeah, with essentially every stat doubling, I had to go crazy. He's just slam boy at this point. It's just the only way he can get open. Oh, Jamar Chase just broke him. Okay, we'll take it. And on fourth down, we had to go right to Jamar Chase, setting up an easy touchdown for number one. Just kidding. Okay, all right. Um, I, He has zero deep route running. I have, to, I have to remember that. Or actually, no, he has 10. And that play right there reminded me that I had to switch up my game plan. I had to go back to the short game, get the ball to Jamar Chase in space, and let him make plays, baby. Oh, yes, sir. He's open. You know, that's not that short, but it's close enough. And although I knew that 99 overall by week five was not doable anymore, I just wanted to get Jamar Chase as many yards as possible and as many points as he could. Yes, he is wide open. Get those yards. And once again, we went right back to number one. Oh, get a block. Get a block. Hayden Hurst, what are you doing? And considering Jamar Chase has been a red zone monster this entire video, we had to go right back to him. Yes, Sarski. Uno. Dude, how many times did he hit the gritty today? And Jamar Chase was hitting gritties both metaphorically and physically because he was just all over the field putting in work this game. Come on, 
break free, Jamar. And with the Ravens dialing up the pressure, I barely get it off to Jamar Chase and this happens. Jamar Chase, house call, no. And eventually we'd march down to the red zone yet again and get Jamar Chase in the end zone again. Pretty much the summary of this game. Oh, this is so easy. Not only was it easy for Jamar Chase, but so it was for his team. 17 to 12, we pull out the gutsy victory. Jamar Chase is lifting 200 yards for the first time this season. And remember, however many yards that we finished with this game was doubled. So Jamar Chase finished with 404 yards, meaning 404 points. And that's just like, I got to work quick. Okay, I feel like 99 awareness is going to be crucial. I mean, at least it was for the quarterbacks when I did this video. I don't know about wide receivers. Deep route running is going to be a 99. Medium route running will boost up a little bit. In release, we should get up to a about an 80, a 90. And he's now up to a 73. Okay, we are making progress. We should have like two or three more games and this should be easy peasy. But although I did fail the challenge of getting him to a 99 overall by week five. So I will have to give away that Jamar Chase Bengals jersey. So stay tuned until the very end. The Jamar Chase now returning to his hometown. This game was so important for him. Not only did Jamar Chase go crazy in real life against the Saints, but he also went crazy in this game. Like no matter what the Saints did, they just could not stop this man. Oh my God, Jamar Chase. Yeah, it was pretty much just like that. He was going crazy all game. The defense could literally do not a single thing, but just pray. Just, you know, kind of like that meme when Austin Rivers was guarding Damian Lillard, you know, it was pretty much just like a, how that went. There is no way Joey B just made that throw and there is no way Jamar Chase is a 73 overall just did that. And it pretty much goes to show that even though he was a 73 overall, it really depends on the things that you upgrade because I upgraded the most important things for him and he pretty much, he played, he played like a 99 overall, I'm not gonna lie. And a shootout thriller, 51 of 45. Bengals secure the dub. Jamar with 287 yards and four touchdowns, just completely eclipsing his career and season high. Actually, no, not, not eclipsing his career high. This man had like 296 yards one game. And with natural causes, Jamar Chase now went up to an 82, but that was before we were able to put in all of those points from last game. 99 change of direction sounds about right. Same for catching traffic. And we should have enough to max out spectacular catch. Moving us up to a 99 overall. Yes, we did it. Granted, we were a week short, but we finally did it. It took six games, six weeks, and we finally did it. This one was a bit of a struggle, dude. Jamar Chase was so hard. I'm not going to lie. But since I didn't do it in five weeks like the original goal stated, I'll be giving away this Jamar Chase jersey. It can be any size, whatever size you want. You just got to contact me on my Twitter. Make sure to follow me, by the way. Like, if you aren't following me, it's just kind of rude. But DM me on my Twitter and let me know what size you want. And obviously, you got to tell me your address once I respond. And yeah, first, first, first come, first serve. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like. And if you want more like this, I did a video similar to this with Justin Jefferson. It's popping up on the screen right here. Boom, click right here. This one was a banger. You're going to love this one.